hope you are doing well. I know you guys have not. Ooh, 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 ooh. No, 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 no. Ooh. I dropped my rise, child. I just made it to the office, my office of Starbucks. Happy, happy Sunday. I hope you're doing well. And I know I have not posted in a minute. I don't know. I guess it's around the holiday time. And I don't know. It's, I, I don't know. It's like I get a little down every holiday time. It's stressful for me and then it was the first time the girls weren't home and just because I haven't posted does not mean I have not done any vlogging I have so I have jumped over numerous videos just to send you this video to let you know for the few who may wonder or care a little bit that I am okay it's just sometimes as th those who know me know that I fall into a rut here and there so if you don't hear from me i'm probably in a rut that i'm trying to crawl out or i'm creating so honestly it's been a little of both and when i say i fall into a rut it's like my motivation may be a little off but you'll never see it you know if i'm working or stuff like that never 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 it's more so when i'm by myself and then, you know, my thoughts um, haven't been too crazy, but, you know, reflecting on my life and and it's always mostly financial, really. I'm like, you know, it's just like it's never ending. And then sometimes not having family and the kids didn't come home. And then sometimes when I'm in my little cave back here, it's so cozy. It's really, really cozy, but it's like that space sometimes can harbor and fester a little dark space sometimes it's good to come out of that space and then I don't want to <laughs> so I felt so guilty yesterday because and yesterday was Saturday it's like I don't leave school. I never leave school before 8 o'clock p.m. Um, sometimes I'm not doing much. Sometimes I'm trying to focus, but I can't. Sometimes I'm like, I done been here to 9, 30, 10 o'clock. I ain't accomplished much. <laughs> so I'm like, what were you doing? I don't know. And so, um, but my goal is to be doing something. Sometimes I am. Sometimes I'm creating. And then I started working on a design, trying to think whether I should put some of my designs on TPT. So some of my um, my old company, I used to have a company called Rappalicious. So some of that has been coming back to the forefront. You know, I'll always, you know, be able to design. My brain doesn't quiet down. So just a full range of emotions that I've been experiencing. So I just wanted you guys to know that I'm okay. And just going through the motions of the holidays like I do every year. Bobby will be home, I believe, on the 17th. Not quite sure of her plans. We kind of have like a, um, uh, um, we have a plan, but we don't have a plan. It hasn't been finalized. So oof, we'll see what happens. And I don't know, I'll just take it day by day. So I'm getting ready to go here. Oh, what I was saying before, it's like I stayed in my cave and the goal was to work to go to the office starbucks and work so i have a starbucks that's not very populated and it doesn't it's not a high traffic starbucks that i discovered and it's like i don't even think anybody is in there right now and so you may have a few people pop in and pop out but not a lot I don't even see any campers in there right now. So when I go to this Starbucks, I camp for like six, seven hours. And um, so I was like, oh, you gotta go to your office, Joy, go to your office. Okay, focus, Joy, focus. Okay, <clears throat> so, I didn't make it so I, I bought some food um and i didn't feel like buying food where i wouldn't eat ice i just didn't want to so i bought some avocados what did i have oh and i bought some chicken salad um i just bought a small chicken salad i, I couldn't eat the whole thing and i bought a big italian bread and i just threw the rest away it, it was just like a little corn it would have been cute with some crackers later something like that but i, I wasn't saving that and then I bought a whole avocado and I put avocado on the chicken salad too. 
and I ate that and I had half an avocado. So I was like, oh, that'll be fine just sitting out. And it was kind of cold. So then I ate that half on another piece of the bread. So it was an open-faced avocado sandwich with an Italian bread. And I had my salt and pepper on there. Ooh, lemon, a little squirt of lemon would've been good. Or lemon pepper. Well, that would've been good. Oh, I'll do that next time. And listen, listen, listen. So I ate that this morning, brushed my teeth, washed my face. I'll go to the gym tonight. Um, take care of my, my, all my beauty needs and all that stuff, my hygiene and stuff. But I do have all types of stuff back there to make sure I'm clean, okay? And like I said, I never uh, go number two in here. Mm, I'll be dead. Never, never. There are too many places to do that. And I don't know, it's weird. I never go to the, you know, go to the restroom. I don't go regularly, so it's not like I always have to go to the bathroom. I don't. I don't go every day. I don't, doctor said it's fine. That's just my body. Everybody's body is different. Um, and as far as the bleeding, I know I need another transfusion. I need an iron transfusion. They've been calling me like crazy for that. Sometimes I just can't take. I don't know. Maybe my limit is what my students asked for. So I came up with a new idea. It's not my original idea, but you know, oh shoot, I need to get my stuff printed today. So I need to find an office depot to get my stuff printed. They be acting weird at my job. I asked um, the computer lady, I begged her to print one sheet for me on cardstock. She ain't even answered that. I'll be getting her money. I was like, oh, you couldn't do me a favor, huh? I said, I, I'm gonna say, I say, I see how you are. Just one sheet. So I want to go get this idea. I designed it and I'll share the idea with you later. I need to really get back on it. So any words of motivation, encouragement, sometimes I just fall into my rut. Ooh, I can feel myself get emotional. I just fall into this rut and I don't really have answers for it. So anyway, <sighs> I'm going to go in here and try to work on it. Remember, I had to do that um, that GT course. Oh, still trying to do that. Then another part of me wanted to draw because that is um, soothing and calming for me. And like I was saying before, I just didn't want to leave the car. So I went to the grocery store, got my snacks, and I still stayed in the grocery store parking lot. And I just parked somewhere remotely. And I watched the movie. And I was like, Joy, you deserve to do nothing one day. But the guilt that I feel is just terrible. And so today I got up, made my breakfast, you know, brushed my teeth and all that stuff. And it's a little late. It's a little late. I slept a long time. I didn't sleep that well last night. I kept waking up, whatever. Um, so now I'm going to go in here and try. Maybe I'll work for like four hours and then say now... If I can do a straight four hours and then um, it'll be a reward to draw. So I'm gonna work on an anchor chart, but I have an idea. Or maybe I should work on my new design idea that I wanna put on TPT that in my mind, I think nobody's gonna buy or even want. <laughs> and of course it has graffiti, graffiti theme. I don't know if anybody will want it, but I could put it on and just see. Maybe just try one one or two products, whatever. So, we'll see. What's the worst that'll happen? Nobody will buy it. And that'll be that. All right. But I'm running. I can feel myself running my mouth. Um, but I have been vlogging here and there. I really have been. I just, I just haven't had the motivation to edit. And then I started to get in my creative mode. I stayed at school until 10, just designing and come with, um, coming up with this design in my head. And I shared it with one other teacher. I said, it's my prototype. And she was like, yeah, I like that. I like that. And so she's going to try to use it after when we come back from Christmas break and implement that. And, you know, her slides and so on and so forth. So we'll see how it goes and see how the children react to it. My students, um, loved it they was like oh yeah that's pretty cool you stayed here until nine o'clock doing it what what i was like yeah i mean it's because it's what i enjoy doing i love what i do so it's it doesn't always feel like work so when i'm not working i feel so guilty <laughs> so let me go in here and try to pretend or something 
I'm gonna get a coffee, but I did do a video on a Starbucks hack where I got a coffee, a, a venti cup for four dollars and I think 35 cents. And I did a whole video on that. So before I go in, I'm gonna order it on my phone because I'm too embarrassed. <laughs> I'm too embarrassed to <laughs> do it in the store. So I'm gonna order it online, right? And then I'm going to add my rise to it. So just want you guys to know. Mama Basil's okay, I'm okay. Basil is okay. I just go through my roller coaster. That's why my stuff's never consistent because can you know in order to be super super successful on YouTube, you have to be consistent with your videos and stuff. I was just like, my head ain't consistent. How about that? My life is not consistent. How about that? Maybe I'll get there one day, maybe I won't. So until then, until next time, I hope you are doing super, super well and keeping your head up and trying to stay positive even through the darkness. Just keep swimming, just keep swimming, just keep swimming and know that it won't be this way forever. And I know that as well, because trust me, I've been to Valley too many times to know that I'll be on top of the mountain it goes up and down, up and down. Life is up and down, for, well, for me anyway. And so, therefore, I know it's, it's not always going to be like this. It's just another phase. Yeah, only in Basil's world. All right, y'all. Make sure you hit the like button, okay? Bye, y'all.